Hi everyone, welcome to Techfly Finance. In this video, I will show you how to withdraw money from web money to Visa cards and MasterCards. So without wasting much of your time, let's get started. Withdrawing money from web money to MasterCards or Visa cards is very simple and straightforward. All what you need to do is to log in into your account. And once you have logged in in your account, that's if you are in your wallet, you just need to come here on transfer. Then you just need to come and press on it to a bank card then you'll be able to withdraw money. But alternatively, you can come over here like, and press on personal, and then you come and press to a bank card. If you use this method, you'll be able to see like how much you're going to be charged prior transferring the money. So I will go ahead and fill the card details in here. So I will enter the card number. So after entering the card number, the next thing which you have to do is to enter the expiry date of your MasterCard or Visa card. So I will go ahead and enter the expiry date. Then in here, all what I need to do is to enter the amount. So let's say that I'm withdrawing $10. So after entering the amount, all what you need to do is to come down over here and press on pay. But in case if you want to see how much you're going to be charged before making the payment, you just need to come and press on here. You can see over here that $13.36 is going to be deducted from my account. Yet, I am only withdrawing $10, meaning I'm being charged about $3.36 for this transaction. This might seem to be a bit higher, but like that's not the case. Like If you are sending a higher amount, this fee is going to remain constant. So you don't need to be afraid that it's expensive. Let's say that maybe you're withdrawing $100. So if I was to put $100 here and I recalculate how much the fee will be, uh, you can see that for $100, we are only going to be charged around $6. I think that's something which is affordable. It's not that much cheap, but it is where it, it is affordable. So like, this is how you can find out how much you're going to be charged for the transaction. So I will go ahead and withdraw $10. So I just need to come and press on it. Uh, the next thing you need to do is just to accept it the terms of use. So you just need to come and press on it, accept. So immediately after accepting the terms and conditions, you'll be directed to this page where you need to enter your account details to confirm that you are withdrawing from your account. So I will go ahead and view my account details. Then you just need to enter the numbers in this picture over here. So it is 66167. Then after that, all what you need to do is to press go to payment. Then here, uh, you'll be required to enter your account password. So I will go ahead and fill my web money account password. After that, you need to come and press again on it, go to payment. The next step is to confirm the payment and you can do that by entering the authentication code either sent to your mobile phone number or the web money mobile application. So if you have got the mobile money uh, app, you just need to come and press on the first option. And if you want to receive the code on your cell phone number, you need to go with the second option. But if you choose to receive the code using your phone number, you are going to be charged about 5 cents. So I will go ahead and request a code on my phone number. Then all what you need to do is to enter the authentication code sent to your phone number over here. Then after that, you just need to come and press on it, confirm payment. Uh, you can see over here that the payment has been successfully completed, meaning that we have been able to withdraw money from our web money account to either MasterCard or Visa card. But in some countries, or rather some banks, do not accept web money. If your withdraw gets declined, don't worry, there are other ways of withdrawing money from web money. And I made a video about this one where I walk you through seven ways on how to withdraw money from web money. So make sure that you can watch that video if your transaction has been declined. Thank you very much for watching this video all the way to the end. And if this video was helpful to you, please do give it a thumbs up. And if you want more videos like this one in the future, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. For now, bye bye. See you in the next video.